No, I now call the honourable member for Bradfield. Thank you, Mr. Deputy Speaker. Mr. Deputy Speaker, in recent months there has been opinion expressed by a number of retailers that it is of considerable concern to them that they are facing the loss of business to competitors over the internet, including competitors based overseas. And naturally, any business person will be concerned to maximise their market opportunities. But after comments were made by a number of retailers and a campaign was commenced at the start of this year and indeed late last year, an inquiry was commissioned by the Productivity Commission which found, for example, that the online share of retail sales in Australia is 6 per cent versus 8 per cent in the US and 11 per cent in the UK, but also makes the point that online commerce is rising inexorably from 35 billion uh, in 2003-04 in Australia to 140 billion in 2009-10. I want to argue, while there's nothing wrong, of course, with retailers making a case, uh, a, a, the, make, making the argument they have. I don't agree with their argument, and I believe it's not appropriate. It's not likely to be effective to seek to hold back the online tide. I think it's effectively futile because online commerce is transforming just about every industry, including retail. I also think it's undesirable because it would deny consumers choice and, based upon some of the arguments that have been made, risks returning Australia to seeking to protect Australian businesses behind tariff barriers. And it's the wrong approach, I'd argue, because the better approach is for the retail sector to embrace the opportunities which the online revolution offers. Yes, you are now open to global competition, but you also have a global marketplace. And there are plenty of terrific Australian success stories in online retailing and in online business. And I want to congratulate and commend all of those Australian businesses which are working so hard to succeed in the online marketplace by delivering offerings which better meet the needs of consumers and offer attractive pricing.